Okay, let's show you the last and final part of uh, this incredible mod. Now, uh, here's a Black Rapid strap. Right now, I actually have uh, just a uh, wrist strap, a Black Rapid wrist strap. It's the same carabiner connector, so it makes no difference. Um, let me mention uh, another thing to you on uh, this little invention I came up with. Uh, so far as you have, uh, obviously, uh, two secure points. Okay, point number one that the Black Rapid itself does not have, even though I'm using a modified Black Rapid. Point number two, um, your uh, tripod link cannot come unscrewed. It is in place. It can actually take about a quarter of a turn max, but it isn't held in place on either side. Part number three, I have three secure points here. Now, I, you don't need this, but I, I uh, colored the third one yellow so you can see it. When this is under full tension, you can see here that this is not taking any tension at all. In other words, in case both were to break, which is really an impossibility, even if the link were to break, and I've actually seen a couple broken links, the uh, Black Rapid link, everything breaks. I'm not making fun of Black Rapid or anything, but these all break. They can break, and I've seen a couple of them break. Even if the tripod link breaks at the screw, you still have the two secure points for the load to dissipate. Right now, I have three secure links. So I have three advantages here that the Black Rapid does not have. Uh, number one, I have the load dissipated to either side of uh, the, the standard strap lugs. Number two, the, uh, the rap Black Rapid link cannot unscrew. And number three, something I can't stand even though I have seven or eight Black Rapid straps, is this bugs me. After a long day of shooting, I hear this noise all day long. That gets to be so irritating. That has been removed. So that is that. Oh, you. A lot of you people have asked me um, what this is. Uh, it's polyester and nylon. This is a Dyneema. It's a two millimeter. You can actually buy 50 foot of it for like 28 dollars. You certainly don't need 50 feet of it. Uh, but you can find this by looking up the words accessory cord on eBay. This two millimeter. Now the breaking force of this is 400 pounds. Okay and it's two millimeters is the thickness on it. Now this is Dyneema. I think it's like a polyester blend. It's actually supposed to be stronger than Kevlar. The white thread in there is just for reflectivity. It comes in various colors, but look for accessory cord on uh, eBay. Um, so the last part of this again is, as you can see here, I've eliminated the noise. It's more comfortable to handhold on a heavy camera like this, or even a normal camera like this with a heavy lens on it, I have the load dissipated to either end of my camera lugs. Advantage number one, advantage number two, this can never unscrew by itself. Advantage number three, really four advantages, if this breaks, the actual screw link on this breaks and it comes out, I still have two connection points. Okay, I still have that. No more rattles, so that's advantage number four. So. This uh, may look slightly obtrusive, but it's actually extremely comfortable. People have asked, well, does this get in the way of your hand? No. I mean, actually, it's only two millimeters. So I actually um, like the confirmation on the grip. It does not get in the way at all. And like I said, all I have to do is just pull some of the slack out by raising your camera up. If you need to get to the battery on either side, you just pull up and scoot it out of the way for removing your battery. So that doesn't get in the way at all. Now the only disadvantage, and I would not call it a disadvantage at all, because now I have no noise, I have security, it won't unscrew, and the load is dissipated, is that people said, well, right here in the corners you're going to get rub marks. Well, everything in life is a trade-off. Eventually I'm going to develop rub marks right here and right over here. Um, but I have security, no noise, and it won't unscrew by itself. I'd rather have rub marks than a camera that's actually dropped to the ground, especially an expensive one. So. Anyway, that's that, and remember this stuff is called accessory cord with a 400 pound braking force, so it's not, it's not uh, cheap stuff. I mean, it's, it's some real tough stuff. Okay, check out the next video. I'm going to show you a Black Rapid uh, upgrade. If you just want to use your regular Black Rapid and you don't have a heavy camera body, and some of mine are not, and you just want to go with a Black Rapid, I'm going to show you a super neat upgrade on the next video. So check it out.